When you think of a major league ball player that will be around for a long time, that has a ton of talent, who's already accomplished a lot in his career, and has only played a few years in the league, only one name pops up, Juan Soto. Baseball News Club presents the Childish Bambino. I'm going to need you to subscribe, follow, like, and please comment on the video. Juan Soto, nicknamed the Childish Bambino, is a baseball outfielder for the Washington Nationals. Soto was born in Santo Domingo, Dominican Republic, and since his arrival in Major League Baseball, has been nothing short of amazing. In fact, his first game, his second Major League at bat, first pitch, he hit a home run, thus getting his first hit, home run, and RBI. What makes Juan very unique is a lot of different things. His approach at the plate, his super amount of talent for his age, and what he's already accomplished. He won a batting title in 2020. He's already won a World Series, been a runner-up for MVP and Gold Glove, and he just turned 22 in October of 2020. A very young player, and he has a unique approach with two strikes where he widens his stance and chokes up on the bat. One thing that also makes Juan very popular with the fans is he's very young, he's extremely confident, and he has something called a Soto Shuffle, where he shuffles towards the the mound at the pitcher, kind of grabs himself, does a little shoulder shuffle, and he started doing this in the minor leagues to basically intimidate pitchers. Then we need to dive in and look at his stats if you want to get all analytical with him. It doesn't matter if it's a left-hander or right-hander. He crushes the ball either way. Home, he batted 333 in 2020. Away, he hit 365. So it doesn't really matter who he faces and where he's at. He's going to crush the pitch. And what's even more amazing, his first pitch in 2020, he hit 786. Yeah. And then with a 1-2 count, he hit 364. Now, there wasn't any stats with him with 0-2, really, because he only had three at-bats in all of 2020 with an 0-2 count. Runners in scoring position, he hit 421. I know you're probably thinking, well, that's just one season. Well, not really. His lifetime on base percentage is 415. He has a lifetime 295 batting average. He has a lifetime 972 OPS. In 2020, he led the league in batting average, on base percentage, slugging, OPS, and OPS plus, and intentional base on balls. He had an on base percentage of 490 in 2020. And the crazy part, he's just getting started with his Major League Baseball career. Thank you very much for watching Baseball News Club.